Hi everyone, today I'm going to show you how to uh, do photo slideshow in Adobe Premiere Pro. So the first thing we need to go is uh, to new project. Uh, this name is old project which is I created long time ago, uh, but you don't need to create old, but you we need to go new project. Then uh, you can see name. We need to name, for, name the project photo slice just photo slide and then save wherever you want to put I say in my profile and then I click OK OK when we open you're gonna see four sections here one two three four this is the name that we just create now uh, photo slideshow so what we need to do is we just uh, move here to app uh, this is my own way uh, for easy to control the uh, the verb space just move it a little bit uh, uh, some people need to keep like this okay it can keep but for me I just need to move up in order to uh, for us easy to control and then so we can just move here uh, you need to close some panel that we don't need uh, make don't need history we other don't need some panel we don't need so we need to close uh, now it's a project we move upstairs we move to up sorry we move to up and then here is saw and uh, to control and here is timeline so in order to do this uh, we need to create a sequence you can see here no sequence sequence no uh, we need to create sequence we go to file here we go to new and then sequence here then uh, then we click screen. We this is also a screen that we we open, we, we, we did uh, we create. And for new, we need to go to setting. Yeah, and then go to setting. We go to custom uh, time base. We go we keep twenty four, and then frame size in like this. Just keep nineteen, twenty, ten, eighty, then square one. This one no need. Display format we twenty four. Mm. Up below we we don't need it just keep and then save preset then we just keep the name photo photo slide just put the name what we want to do and then now it's coming just wait a minute photo slide yeah we already created now here this one photo slide and then okay and now we got <coughs> so this screen number one now is the time for us to make your photo slide so here we need to select your photo photo i put where the photo maybe i just select some old photo just a few photo Okay. okay and then we move our photo to the screen you move here in order to do you just move here you can see here a uh, audio line sorry with all line with all line with all line so what we need to do is just go to line number one and add them in audio one audio two or your screen in sound this line is for photo and video so I want to play this house look like okay it's look like this this photo okay it's, you can see here uh, the picture is uh, a little bit bigger than the, f the frame size so we need to adjust this photo so in order to adjust the photo or the frame size you need to select all so you need to select all this photo and then right click you're gonna see scale to the frame size okay, you can see here is smaller all is scale to the frame size you can see our photo is in the frame size it's not bigger than okay now it's okay so if we want to add 
menu search you just click here again uh, you go to menu search uh, what menu search that you love I just put uh, you love this is my uh, whole menu search and then I just put below and then you can play uh, photo with the music you can see but uh, because this photo uh, sorry this music is longer you need to adjust this music to here okay and then what we need to do this photo we want to do some put transaction in order to be uh, look more beautiful more professional you need to go to effect to effect and then you can see effect here then you can see uh, video transition just go to video transition you can see the zoom any any section that you like you can try uh, and try 3d motion then I take uh, just testing just put in the middle just put in the line here just put in the line and then play it look like this you can see here uh, maybe we don't need this we need this one but try this one move to here Oh, it's like this it flip over uh, maybe you don't like this one you can take this one more time uh, any any anything that you want to go I think I need this one I need to remove this first I need to delete this uh, clear this one I need to clear the old one then I maybe I try this one just put in the middle of line yeah here you can put in the line here to make the with the transition okay I like this one so how if how do we do if we have more than let's say we have around 100 we photo or thousand photo we cannot just click one by one like this it take long time if we have more more photo in in this uh, project so what we need to do we need to select all two up and then shift you can press shift b you can see yeah sorry uh, yeah you can see if we put all shift d is all is applied all transaction is applied all photo so it just do one time to all together you don't need to waste your time so just play again you can see a transaction is applied on portal here yes it's looking better and then you just take a very quick you don't need to take your time to do one by one you just select on and then do one time so now is the video already created so what we need to do we need to how to do we need to import this video to upload in our YouTube so we need to go to uh, file upstairs this is file and then down you can see each part here and then go to media okay it's for media it's so something like this and then you can select here beside you can select this H264 then here you you can select any if you want to post on Facebook you can select Facebook here but uh, for me I like to post on YouTube so I need to post I need to find YouTube I need to find you find YouTube uh, downstairs down down here yeah. YouTube here I need to select YouTube here YouTube 1080 PhD so I select YouTube here okay and then the output name here you can put whatever you want to put for me I put a uh, photos photo slide 
before we make it. and then save wherever you wherever you want to save I just save in my old file and then click save here and then go down again you can see here this is the uh, summary here they mean 1920 1080 it, that, that mean our old screen we need we, we that we already create so what we need to consider more is uh, you can move down a little bit down you can see here is the bitrate setting here you can see bitrate setting here original is 16 so for me 16 is a little bit big so for me I like to reduce to 8 when we reduce 8 the size of photo here the size of file here it become 64 let me test 18 again the, and then then the size here is big, uh, uh, more big so it depends on your internet speed if internet speed is really very good or uh, high speed you can just put 16 but uh, in my internet area it's just I put only half you can see it megabyte is uh, down and then here you're gonna select screen in screen out and then all okay then you start each part here this part here okay starting now uh, the time here is depend on your video your photo if your photo more a long hour is gonna take long but because this photo is I just select uh, 10 photo something so the time is a bit fast so the the speed it depend on your internet and the file size so this file size is not so big so it is take faster to to download to export the file so it just take a few minutes uh, actually a few seconds in order to complete Okay, now it's complete uh, the video we already create. So we just go to see the video that we just export. I go to my file, I go to my file here. And here I go to see my uh, photo slide. So, photo slide. I should just go to my old file that we just get photo slide here. Okay, it's just play. Yeah. Sorry. Yeah, very good. You can see. Okay. Yeah, it's very good. And then all look good. All photos look better. So that's all what I want to show you how to make your photo slide. So if you like it, please uh, help to subscribe and press the bell and comment. We have more time and thank you so much for your uh, for your time and then hope you enjoy it and then see you next time thank you so much